Hello YouTube, this is Lugia Daryl27 here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to rip music out of a GBA ROM. Um, so these are the applications you guys are going to need. Um, you guys are going to need Symphont, the first version, which is uh, this one right here. I'll throw a link in the description below to download it. What you want to download is you want to download this part. You want to download this part right here. And another one you're going to need is GBA Music Ripper. I'll also throw a link in that description too as well to download it. Um, it's going to help you rip out the music from the ROM um, to the to the ROM. So yeah. And you also might want to download Java just to be on the safe side in case, you know, CMD doesn't work very much. Um, so I'll throw a link in that description as well. Okay, so I'm basically going to show you guys how to rip uh, music from a GBA ROM. So what you want to do is you want to download, you want to download this right here, right here. I already have it download. All you do is um, just copy the paste this and then just put it right there and you download it. Just click your human and then you download it. So, okay, so I already have it downloaded. So I'm going to show you guys what I did. So I'm going to click CMD. You want to open file file location properties. Open file location again. So you want to go deep into it. You want to you want to go deep into the file so you get the actual CMD. So you're going to paste that. I already have it, so I'm going to just do it anyways. Try again. I it says that I already have it, so I'm just gonna leave it as that so you guys just do what you gotta do okay so you want to type in CMD and here's what you guys are gonna do so follow what I'm gonna do okay I'm gonna put GBA colon so it's that below line muse colon colon right there and then ripper you're not gonna space anything you're not going you're just gonna copy exact exactly like this like this so you're gonna do it like that and you want to you want to get your ROM monster so it's gonna be provided right here so if it's so named something like this hold up for example hold up guys let me get this out for a sec so if it's something like this hold up hold up a second guys um, Okay, so if it's something like this, Monster Force, I would rename it. I would just name it something shorter, like Monster, or whatever you guys, you know, prefer. So it's going to be easier like that. Okay, so, so you're going to put in monster.gba and press enter. Okay, so I did it wrong, so this is what you guys are going to do. GBA colon news colon ripper and then the name of your ROM dot GBA and it's gonna rip out all the music that you already own so <coughs> we'll give this a second so this is an updated version on how to do this for some of you guys that don't know how to do this um, it's pretty simple um, all you do is just all you need is just GBA Music Ripper. I know there was another video on you know on how to do this, but this is an updated version for you guys. Okay, so once you guys got that, you guys are gonna get a file inside your GBA Music Ripper. Um, it's gonna become Monster. So whatever it is, it's gonna have all the music contained into it. So. This is the file that you guys are looking for. It's called monster.sf2. That's what you're going to need to play. Um, this is the application that you're going to need to play the ROM. It's called synth font. You're going to need to download this synth font 1 as a full installation package. So you guys will want to download that. I'll throw a link in the description. But I already have that, so I don't need to have it again. So, okay, so this is what you guys are going to do. First of all, you guys are going to want to open up the song that you want um, I'll just throw in zero and what you guys will want to do is you want to do this 
So you're going to do this and then right click and then assign assign um, the SF2. So you're going to assign it to the whole track. Yes. And this is what you're going to this is what you guys going to get. Now, if you want to <coughs> if you want to play the music, this is the button right here to play it. I'll give a demonstration. If you guys want to loop it, you can you could just press loop right here and let's see. So it's basically ripping out the whole it just ripped out the whole track. You want to get the SM2 for the music to work, so um, now for some of you who want to save this um, the save the song, all you want to do is play to file. But you can't loop it, so you can play to file and it's basically going to save it as a WAV file so you just put it like wherever you want like I would put it in my music and it's going to play back what you just played um, and I'll show you guys um, like where it's going to be located in that um, it's going to be in your guys's music so let me find music going to be in your guys' music. Hold up a second. I don't even know where my music's at. Oh, here. Music right here. And it's going to be right here, this file. So this is going to be the WAV file. So... be the wave file right here and it's probably gonna play the sound that you already extracted and that's how you rip GBA music from pretty much a wrong so I I know you guys have some other questions like I want to rip I want to be able to rip any GBA game well here's the thing here's the downside to that you this application can't rip a lot of GBA games, which is a downside because you know a lot of people want to rip, want to be able to rip music from you know the GBA music ripper. But unfortunately, you can't. Like I'll give an example for that. Um, I'll go ahead and put. Hold up a second. Let me go ahead and go in my file. I'll give you guys an example on that. So let's just say. GBA colon muse colon ripper. Let's say I want to rip shaman dot GBA. Okay, this is a uh, shaman right here. GBA. This is the file I want to rip. But when I click on it, it says sappy sound engine detector. No sound engine was found. So basically what that means guys is that you can't rip you can't rip every GBA game from this software unfortunately because you know it's it's not no one hasn't developed uh, an application yet to rip so like some games for example like Konami like they use code to uh, listen to the music but like that's going to be hard to find so um yeah so that's pretty much it what I wanted to cover Alright guys, so that is how to rip a GBA. That's how to that's how to that's how to rip music from a GBA game. Um, hope you guys like it and thank you guys for watching.